Make your point on the news hour. Join Arnav every night on the news hour with your question. Ask your question and join the debate. Republicans have officially nominated Donald Trump as their presidential nominee for the upcoming elections in the United States. Trump's nomination was announced by Chairman Paul Ryan at the Republican National Convention in Cleveland. We are going to win the state of Ohio. And also, of course, we're going to win the presidency and bring real change and leadership back to Washington. This is going to be a leadership, by the way, that puts the American people first. We're going to bring back our jobs. We're going to rebuild our depleted military and take care of our great veterans. We're going to have strong borders. We're going to get rid of ISIS. And we're going to restore law and order. We have to restore, and quickly, law and order among many and just so many other things. And I'll be discussing with that Thursday night. We'll be talking all about it. But together, most importantly, we are going to make America great again. Uh, a huge uh, outcome and uh, support from people. Trump supporters are very happy that this has come through. And now it's yes. official that him and uh, Hillary Clinton, who's probably going to be nominated next week, are going to be doing the face-off in November. Mm -hmm. Also announced his vice presidential pick, which is the Indiana governor, Mike Pence. He was also formally nominated with this. And this is a four-day event that's going to go on. And they're expected to give their answer by Thursday, which is the end of the convention. But we're expecting the response to be sooner than that, probably by tomorrow itself. The whole family was there when he got nominated, and um, we're still getting the updates on this as we speak. The main thing that we're really looking for is really who's going to be putting out the key focus points that people really want to hear. And with all the turmoil right now, as you can see, that's going on between the people and mm -hmm. the law enforcement in America, that seems to be the main driving force of everything. You're just talking about their um, international policies is another, another thing, picking up the economy is another thing, which are a lot of things that Trump has not focused on so far. Okay. He's gone around a lot of issues, but these are the key things now that he's going to have to step up to see now which two of these candidates are really going to take it and drive it home and right. see what their policies and how they're going to change America for the next four years. A commitment to a renewed commitment to building a 21st century military and giving our veterans the care that they were promised and the care that they earned. And we offer a better way for dealing with persistent poverty in this country. A way that shows poor Americans the world beyond liberal warehousing and check writing into the life everyone can find with opportunity and independence. The happiness of using your gifts and the dignity of having a job. And you know what? None of this will happen under Hillary Clinton. Only with Donald Trump and Mike Pence do we have a chance at a better way.